Hello you beautiful, beautiful people. Today we're jumping back into the festival playlist for this week's final spring season of Series 3 to take on this week's Force on Challenges Mid-Engine Madness. We're going to be grabbing those all-important Force on Points, the much-needed points towards the festival playlist. So if you are new around here, definitely consider subscribing so you can easily find your way back to the channel for more videos just like this one. A like rating would be much appreciated and let's jump into today's video. For this week's Force Sun Challenges, we are jumping in the beautiful 2020 Chevrolet Corvette Stingray. This car was given to everyone at the beginning of the game, so there's no reason why you shouldn't own one. But if you don't, it is available from the Auto Show for 65,000 credits. I do have a tune available if you want to go ahead and use it. It is running 800 horsepower and rear wheel drive in S1900. Share code is in the description and in the comments below, or just search my gamer tag Skippy4631 or the file name Skippy YouTube. Let's kick things off with this week's Forza Ton Shop. First car for grabs, the 2019 Aston Martin Valhalla Concept, 600 Forza Ton points. This bad boy can be picked up in the auto show for 1,150,000 credits or can be won through wheel spin. Second car for grabs, the awesome McLaren 600 LT Coupe can be picked up for 400 Forza Ton points. It's also available at the auto show for 260,000 credits and can also be won through wheel spins. We've got the gold leather boots and the duck quack car horn, which sounds a little bit like this. Which for some reason for me is echoing. I'm not sure if it's supposed to do that, but 75 Force on points for each of these. It is worth noting these can only be picked up through the festival players or the Force on shop, so grab them while you can. We've got one normal wheel spin for 80 Force on points, and we've got a super duper wheel spin for 300 Force on points. Now we will take a look at the rest of the rewards for this week's first place at the end of the video, but first we'll jump in and get this week's Forza Ton Challenges Mid-Engine Madness completed. Starting with Chapter 1, Garden Gate. Own and drive the 2020 Chevrolet Corvette Stingray Coupe to get a taste of the first mid-engine Corvette since the model's introduction. For own and drive, hop outside any festival site or your player house. You can even have your car delivered to you. Drive two seconds down the road. And Garden Gate completed. So with Chapter 1, Garden Gate completed, it is on to Chapter 2, Racing Heritage. Flaunt the Chevrolet Corvette Stingray Coupe by winning two road racing series events to show what you are made of. For this chapter, head on into your map and filter by road racing events, making it a little bit easier to see and find. I'm going to be using a lookout circuit just north of Guanajuato. You can use any race from the road racing series. As the lookout circuit is one of this week's seasonal championships, I'm just gonna hit Y to switch to normal event, head into solo, head on over to Event Lab Creations, where I have created a cheeky blueprint called Forzathon Chapter 2. If you wanna use it, there is a share code 279-988. 891. Now, as driver type difficulty does not affect the weekly of Forzathon races, there's no reason to make this harder than it needs to be as we do need to win two road racing events. I'm going new racer. And as we approach the finish line of race number one, and it is on new racer, so it's nice and easy across the line, first place. As we round the final corner for race number two, we come up to the finish line to cross the line, first place. And there we go, Racing Heritage completed. With Chapter 2, Racing Heritage completed, it is on to Chapter 3, Jet Fighter Inspo. Earn 10 Ultimate Air Skills in your Chevrolet Corvette Stingray Coupe to get a true feel of the fighter jet inspired interior. Now this chapter can be completed pretty much anywhere within the free roam map as long as you've got some elevation and some sort of jump, but I think undoubtedly the best place to head is near the Horizon Baja outpost and using the Dunas Blancas sand dunes. Before this chapter, you've got to take your Chevrolet off-road, you've got to hit some sand dunes, get some air, and hopefully get those ultimate air skills. There's one, take it off again. This should be number two. There we go, ultimate air skill, eight to go. And after gracefully earning 10 ultimate air skills using the sand dunes at Dunas of Blancas, the notification does slightly pop up, but that is Jet Fighter Inspo completed. So with Chapter 3, Jet Fighter Inspo completed, it's on to our fourth and final chapter this week, Sting in the Tail. Up the ante by reaching speeds of 194 miles an hour while checking out the all-new LT2 V8 engine 
through the rear hatch window. Once again this week, chapter 4 can be completed absolutely anywhere within the freeway map as long as you've got enough length to get that 194 miles an hour. But I think undoubtedly the best place to head is the motorway that runs through the middle of the map. Here we go then, 194 in the 2020 Chevrolet Corvette Stingray. Let her rip, Taylor Chip. My tune does take a little bit of time to get there, but it will get there eventually. I think it does about 220. Let's keep the throttle planted. Keep going up through those gears. That's 180 up into sixth. Keep her going. There it is, 194. Mid engine madness completed. So with chapter four, Sting in the Tail completed. That is this week's Force and Challenges Mid Engine Madness done and dusted. 160 of Force and Points in the bank and five points towards our spring hot season. Speaking of the spring hot season, up for grabs this week. For 25 points, we got the Jaguar XKRS 2015. And for 45 points, new to Forza Horizon 5, not new to the Forza franchise, the Vauxhall Carlton. For this week's online trial, I had the Tiger. We got a clothing reward of the Horizon exclusive pencil dress. This week's event lab challenge, up for grabs, the Carhorn Halo Shield recharge. For the seasonal playground games, Spring Festival Gala, we got the awesome number 23 Nissan PR. For this week's three PR stunts, the normal three wheel spins up for grabs. Seasonal championships, hear me a roar, we got the Buick Regal GNX. For the Earn Your Stripes championship, we've got a clothing reward of the purple stripe knee-high socks. And for the last seasonal championship, Battle of the Big Cats, we've got the Jaguar XES. For this week's treasure hunt, we've got 50,000 credits up for grabs. For this week's photo challenge, a party till dawn, we've got the car horn fireworks. For this week's a horizon open challenge, we've got one wheel spin. And for the eliminated challenge this week, we've got the clothing reward of the Rural Urus cap. This week's looking pretty good for rewards. Even the Forza on Shop is looking pretty good as well. But as always, thank you so much for watching. If you are new, definitely consider subscribing. We are getting very close to 20,000 subscribers. A like rating would be much appreciated. Stay safe and have an awesome day.